Good afternoon, it's uh, Jake here with, from North Star Performance. Um, today I'm going to show you how to do some quick updates to your vehicle um, with nothing more than a laptop and a DrewTech Mongoose GM2 cable. Um, with this particular cable and a laptop computer, you can reprogram basically every module in the vehicle as well as perform security relearns. Um, let's say if you lose a, an ignition key um, and have to replace it. Um, other things you can do with it is re reprogram key fobs. Um, yeah, pretty much everything. You can also run uh, GM Tech 2 Win, um, which is a program on your on your laptop that you can download through GM's website that allows you to technically do everything that a Tech 2 scanner can do on your GM vehicle. Um, so this car in particular here that I'll be working on is a 2007 Cadillac DTS. Uh, it belonged to my mom actually and ended up in a, in a collision. Uh, I'm fixing it for her slowly, but in the meantime, using it for a bit of R&D in the, in, the, in the process. So I'll get to work and I'll show you how this works. So what we're going to do now is plug this mongoose cable into the vehicle's OBD2 port, uh, which on this Cadillac DTS and most other GM vehicles is located underneath the dash. Um, so it's right down here, and you just plug that in, like so, and you're ready to connect to the vehicle. So we're going to turn the key on. Um, this here is a PCM that was recently programmed uh, to the VIN of this car. Um, right now you're going to see that there is the security icon that is lighting up on the dash. Um, some GMs you can actually do a 30 minute key learn process um, where you don't need to connect to the vehicle with um, with the Tech 2 or, or any other software. Uh, some vehicles it will not work. The, uh, the 30 minute relearn so you're you are forced to go through service programming in order to get that um, get that message removed uh, right now I can try starting the car it won't do anything so we are going to use the drew mongoose um, mongoose 2 uh, the GM2 unit as well as uh, AC Delco Tech Connect um, got that on my laptop here we're going to use that to learn the um, PCM to the vehicle so I will get started on that now we have set it up with the uh, like through a service programming system um, that we're doing a relearn procedure right now um, it's gonna take about 13 minutes uh, right now it says 12 minutes remaining um, so now we just wait and uh, let this unit do its thing and pretty soon we'll be able to turn the the ignition back off and then when we go to start the vehicle it'll start so the 13 minutes is up now. Um, it gives me the option to uh, clear clear the diagnostic trouble codes, proceed with same VIN number, new or cancel. I'm gonna I'm going to hit cancel now because we're finished. Um, so we can close this up. Um, you'll see the security light on the dash is out now. So I'm just going to sh turn the key off, pull it out for just about maybe 30 seconds or so. I can disconnect the uh, Drew Tech cable. Yeah, you'll see that the airbag airbag was blown on this car. It was in a wreck, so still works good as an R&D car for now. And so I've put the key in the ignition and go to start the vehicle. It should now start. You'll see the security light goes out as it should. After it does its segment check. There. The engine's running. The key learn has been completed. And that concludes our video here on how to do a key relearn on a 2007 Cadillac DTS. Um, the same procedure will work for a lot of other vehicles. Um, I've got a check engine light, I'll find out another day what that's all about, but yeah, the security relearn is all set. Um, so you'd follow this, the same process basically if you had to replace the ignition key. Um, you can go by the VIN number, you can go to the dealership, they can cut you a new key but for these vehicles it still needs to be learned to the, the vehicle itself so you still have to go through that process. Uh, if you want to save some money um, getting a Drew Tech cable is I'm going to say that's definitely the way to go. Alright, bye for now.